Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a review slash swatch video for you guys on the ColourPop Ultra Metallic Lips. Now I know everyone has been going crazy and crazy about the Kylie Jenner products and that I don't really think I've seen many reviews or swatches or videos on the ColourPop ones. So I thought I would go ahead and show you guys. Plus it's more affordable than the ColourPop sorry than the uh, Kylie Jenner ones so if you guys want to see my review and swatches on these products then please keep watching okay so when I ordered this it took about a week or so to arrive and it came in this plain old box that says made in LA and it says fragile on these sides now I thought that the exterior of the box would look a lot more like fancy and a lot cuter but I guess for security reasons that keep people's products safe they wouldn't they didn't do that so uh, you open up I've already opened this package already I've already swatched it so it's not a first impressions video I've already opened and, and saw everything inside I was too excited to wait so I already know what the colors look like I did swatch them on my hands but I did not swatch them on my lips so whatever looks whatever color it looks like on my hand may not look the exact same on my lips so um, carrying on I'm going to open up this box so this is what the interior of the box looks like I like the, the interior of it it's cute it's like a golden pink kind of florally detail and it says color pop with flowers all around it and it came with this little foam uh, bit to protect your products as well as it came with one on the top but I um, took that one out so this is what it looks like inside can you see that there you go so that's what it looks like inside and inside comes with the products so I got six different products I got four of the metallic lips one of the ultra matte and a sculpting stick um, I'll briefly show you guys those ones, but I, this video is mostly about the metallic lips. And then it came with your invoice and receipt. It also came with a customized card, which I thought was so, so cute in their little personal, personalized card. And then it also came with a little guide book on all the different products and the tips and tricks on how to use each product so how to use the super shock shadow you know a whole bunch of different products inside I thought that was really cute and really informative for those who are trying ColourPop products for the first time product I'm going to show you which is not part of this video I'm going to show you the sculpting stick so I got the sculpting stick I've tried it and to be honest with you it didn't even do anything for me. Um, I got it in the color Easy Peasy, which is like a brownish, um, gray color, and that's good for doing your cons doing your highlight to give it more of that shadowy effect. But this is the color; like you can barely even see it on me. I think this color would look good on very like white or light skinned uh, woman I think this color would look amazing I actually saw this color on Alyssa Forever's uh, YouTube page and I thought maybe it might work on me but it really really doesn't it doesn't show on my skin so that kind of sucked Okay, so the next product I have is the Ultra Matte Lips. Now, I've been wanting to get this color for the longest time, and it's always been sold out. So, it is the, it is the color LAX, and it's like a burgundy reddish color. Oh, I cannot wait to wear this in the fall. So I'm going to swatch that and show you what this color actually looks like. So, this is it. It is absolutely freaking gorgeous. Like, 
oh I cannot wait cannot cannot wait to wear this color so there's that so on to the very exciting part of this video the metallic swatches okay so I've already kind of blanked out my lips to actually show you guys the true color of these lipsticks so I'm just gonna zoom in a little bit okay so zoomed in a bit so you can kind of see a little bit more of a closer look at what I'm about to do so the first color I am going to try is lights out so this is what the packaging looks like it's probably a little hard to see but that's what the packaging looks like and okay open up and this is the color. I don't know if you can really see that, but that's the color of it. <laughs> to put it on my cheek maybe so you can see it a little bit better. But that's the color of it. This seems a little light, I, I, I have to say. But you never know. Okay, so from looking at this product, it does kind of streak and open up let me see let me show you real quick what I mean so this is what it does in the inside so it looks like there's there's quite a bit of product in there I'm not sure if it's because of the nature of the product but it really like you could see through it also there's a lot of product on the applicator itself I don't know if you can really tell now I don't know if it's because it's a lighter color or what but should should this be happening <laughs> like let me know cuz I don't know but to me, I don't think this should be happening and that all this product is on the stick itself. That's like I'm losing a ton of product that way. But anyways, let's go ahead and swatch this bad boy. Okay, so the first swipe of it, it's actually pretty pigmented. Um, however, you may have to go in with a second coat. So let's do the top. Let's just do that. Uh, this kind of gives me like Cleopatra, very like Egyptian vibes. I'm actually kind of feeling this color real quick. Uh, it is, it isn't buttery, so I don't know if, um, uh, these are supposed to be buttery, but it is not buttery. So, there's that. I mean, as you could see, I didn't, okay. You have to go in with a couple of coats on this one. It's, it's pretty, sh it's, no. No, it's not as pigmented, pigmented as I thought. And it does streak. So it's kind of hard. Like as you can see, I'm kind of like dabbing it, dabbing it on to kind of get it together. I don't know. It's a cute color like Like, if you're going out on a night or something, like, I don't know. I feel like this color would, like, be so bombed. But, on, like, every day, like, every day, no. But, or you can actually use this color to do the middle of your lips. So, if you want to do an ombre effect, I think that will look nice with this. But, day to day, I mean, no. It... It is a little sticky. Um, yeah, it's a little streaky. Like, you have to put on quite a bit of, a bit of coats to kind of get this going. 
color I am going to try is zebra now I was actually really excited to try this color very 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 excited to try this color so let's see what this one does okay so this one seems pretty good it doesn't do the whole empty look to it so that one is pretty pretty good I don't know if it's because it is super pigmented that um, or it has a lot more color that it doesn't do that or there's a lot of products in here oh no but I'm liking that it's not doing what the first one I tried did so let's watch this this one seems to apply a little better than light so this has more of like um a, a muted sheen to it I think all of them you have to really kind of I think all of them you have to kind of go over them quite a few times to get like that pigment and that metallic look to show through um I mean I'm only on my second one but Yeah, I think you have to go with quite a few cups. Now this one is, it does have a little bit of patchiness to it. Very little. But it does, it is a lot more pigmented than the other one. So this is what Zebra looks like. Okay, my lips are starting to get so dry and like they're starting to burn. Mm, I'm not, mm, 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 mm. All of this for you guys. All of these. I'm gonna get tapped. Look, look, look at my lip. <laughs> like they just, they don't feel right. Like, what? Why is this bottom heart like drooping? Like, what's going on, lips? Like, get it together. Two more. This is my third one. So, and this is the color Three Way. So, looking at this, Three Way and Zebra are very similar in color. This is more of like a purpley color, and this one here is has a little bit more of like a rosy kind of color to it. So this also does that little streaky see-through bit in the bottle. I don't know if you guys can kind of see that. Let me get it for y'all. There we go. So it does do that in the bottle. Now why I'm not upset about this and, I, and why people were so upset about the Kylie Jenner ones is because the Kylie Jenner ones were like, how much were they like 20 bucks 20 whatever how much this is only like six dollars so this is less of a loss than the Kylie Jenner metallic lip fiasco so this doesn't really bother me that much I'll probably still use the product also I heard that ColourPop had a um, horrible batch of this and then they redid it and have a, had a good batch so I don't know if I'm part of the good batch or the bad batch I am not 100% sure if I am part of the good batch and this is happening then Colourpop y'all need to get it together y'all have to make a third batch so anyways I'm gonna go ahead and try three way oh praise Jesus my lips are cracking like they're getting all dry and cracking. Like look at my lips. Okay, when you apply, when you put this on, please moisturize your lips before you put this on, because you're gonna have you're gonna look like you're you're a whole lot older than you are. Three way actually applies nicer than 
Zebra and Lights Out. Um, yeah, I don't really see any patchiness with this one. However, it's like a glittery metallic-ness to it. I don't, uh, none of the other ones had glitter in it, so I don't, maybe this one's supposed to have a little glitter, I'm not sure, but the other ones did not have any glitter to it, but this one has, yeah, you can even see, like, it's kind of glittery, metallic-y, um, but this one does really, really show that metallic-ness, glitteriness to it, so, yeah, it's, it's, it's nice. It's really nice to be honest with you. Yeah, no, no, no. It's <laughs> it's nice. All right, guys. The last color. Oh my, my lips cannot take this anymore. My lips. But I got one more color for y'all. One more color. Okay. <laughs> so the last color I got for you guys is. Man Eater. Man Eater. Okay, so Man Eater is in the same family as Three Way and Zebra. So they are, all three of them are in the same family, and this is Lights Out. So, hmm. I think I might be, I think I might like Zebra, uh, Three Way. So. Let's swatch this bad boy. Okay, hold on. Before we swatch this, do you not see the amount of product on the top of this one? Like, why does it do that? Why does so much of, like, look at the inside. I don't know if you can see the inside. But so much of the product is seeping out of the tube. Like, is that even supposed to be happening? Yeah, like there's so much product in the tip of this. So, that's not a good thing, but we're going to swatch this because you're losing a lot of product. I understand it's $6 and I understand what whatever. The inside of the tube, I didn't mind too much when it was doing, giving those empty spots inside the tube. But the outside of the tube, if there's so much product outside of the tube, nah man. Anyways, let's swatch this. Okay, so I'm actually using the product that is outside of the tube because I didn't even dip my um, applicator back in and out. I'm just using the product that is outside of the tube. And look at how much product, you can tell. This is a lot of product that is outside of this tube. Okay, so I am feeling man eater. I think I like the light, the light colors. Um, yeah, I'm really feeling this color. It does streak a bit. Yeah, you can see some streaking here, a little bit here. So some streaking here, a little bit over here. There's a little bit of streaking, but if you, you know, apply a few coats and get a lot more of a pigment, then it um, is perfect. I absolutely... I really, really, really do like this color. It is really pretty. The metallic shines through nice. And yeah, let's see if these colors are actually transferable. Okay, so they do transfer. They're not um, super matte. They do transfer. Um, you don't really lose much product when you, if you drink or kiss or do any of that stuff. So... Yeah, I'm going to give you guys my overall review on all of these products. Okay, so my overall review on these products is that they are nice products. Um, they are a little sheer and patchy, um, especially in the lighter colors. However, I do love Man Eater. Um, the, what I do not like about these is that a lot of product comes on the applicator and inside the ring of the tube, there's a, there is a lot of product outside of that tube where you don't even have to dip your applicator back in and out because there's so much around the, the, um, interior of the tube itself. Um, would I purchase these again? No. 
unless you guys want to see another review on the other colors then I will but I don't think I will purchase these again Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next upload. Bye guys.